I've been scrolling around my dashboard on YouTube and also on my Instagram and I keep seeing a lot of contents that are circling around retro film looks. As you all know, majority of the cameras that are being sold in the market are one of the top tiers and high-end technologies wherein you can get as much as 4K or 5K resolutions. But there are this group of people who are really interested into this kind of old film look and how the digicams would look like. Well, some of you might not be familiar with the word digicam. This used to be the high-end cameras if you have it between the 2000s up until 2010. And since I am one of those millennials, definitely inabot ko to. And even though if we are already using the high-end quality cameras and the most versatile video editing apps right now, we can still reproduce and recreate this digicam look or the old film effect using Wondershare for more 12. And if you guys are interested to see it, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the channel first so you won't miss a single episode. Alright, so the first thing we need to do is to upload at least one raw video and I have chosen at least one of the raw footages that I had back in 2020 when I went to Bali, Indonesia. So, ilagay niyo yung mismo clip on the second line of the timeline and then we're going to put another stock image here which is just a plain black background and you will know why I did this. Next up, your raw footage will just have to crop this up and make it into 4x3 ratio since majority of the footages that we have back in the days are on this ratio. And once you're already done with the cropping of your image, this is how it would look like as a playback ninyo. Now, once you're already done, what we're after is we need to make the actual video look like it was shot back in 2000s more of the clips that we have back then are highly exposed and more on the warm tone colors but back then kaya pa rin naman siyang baguhin into cooler hue pero for the sake of editing this one out using the Wondershare Filmora we're going to achieve the warmer tone and high exposure shot and to do this just right click your raw footage and go to color grading so on the project info side click color all the adjustments of your color grading will be moved depending on your taste. Since I mentioned that the photo or the video is highly exposed, we'll have to bring the exposure on its higher level at least around 40. Siguro pwede na yun, para naman makita yung mukha ko. And then the brightness, a few adjustments. And then put the contrast on its lowest para at least magmukha ngayon siyang grainy at hindi ganun katingkad ngayon yung kulay ng skin. Let's also adjust the vibrance and the saturation. Let's bring it a little bit lower para magmukhang mas pale ngayon yung skin since yung pixelation kasi ng mga digicams are lower than 10 megapixels. My digicam, it's around 5 megapixels lang siya. Then let's also adjust some parts of the whites and the blacks of the actual footage. I guess this one is pretty good for me. Now let's move on to adding some layers. Since some of the videos and photos kasi noon are a pretty bit grainy, we'll try to look for a grainy effect na yun dito sa ating effects panel. And either you can consider going to the subtle grain, very dirty grain, or very dirt subtle grain, or very dirty film. And let's put it on the third layer of the timeline. Kung mapapansin ngayon ninyo, the hue of the video is pretty much on the warmer tone and it's overexposed. And now, aside from doing the 4x3 ratio, let's try to add on some film effect around it too. So on your effects panel, we'll have to go for a film effect. And there you go. So yun yung parang nagiging inconsistency effect ngayon ng mga older cameras before. And that's what I'm trying to achieve in this video. And that's how you do the simple old film video effect using the Wondershare Filmora. You can actually still look for other effects Try to play with your color grading to at least achieve how the old films would look like if you'll be taking a photo or a video out of it. And if you guys find value on this content, don't forget to hit the like button on this video, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace!